Is that a camera? Oh, okay. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Salam sejahtera. Um, let's talk about ambition. When we grow up, everyone has an ambition. And um, when we have ambition, it will drive our behavior. Um, I'll go straight to the point. What's USM's ambition? Apa kita ni cita-cita? We have taglines like we lead, we are the preferred university, we transform education for a sustainable tomorrow. What are our ambitions? What are our dreams? Can we say that our ambition is we are the preferred university because we lead in transforming education for a sustainable tomorrow? Is that, is that acceptable for everyone? Okay, now, a um, couple of things there. If we say we transform education, have we actually seen any transformation? If we say sustainable tomorrow, what tomorrow do we have in mind? What kind of tomorrow that we have in mind? And uh, when we say we lead, isn't lead it's pretty much the same as being different with everyone else? Now, if you refer to this slide, if you look at that uh, graph, you see that on the y-axis is USM's performance. And in the x-axis is the number of years. Now you see on that graph, you have two trajectories, trajectory number one and trajectory number two. Trajectory number one is what we've been doing for the past four or five months. Trajectory number one, to some people, is very difficult. And yet, if we continue, even if we actually perform, we are still in trajectory number one. Trajectory number one will bring us to be the same as UM, UKM, UKM, UPM, all the other universities. In that sense, we're not leading. In that sense, we're just one university among the rest of the university. That's trajectory number one. And if you look at that, we will require at least two or three years to continue improving in trajectory number one. Now, trajectory number two is all about ambition. Trajectory number two is all about USM being different from everyone else. If you look at it from a different perspective, you have on Y axis strategic importance and on the X axis urgency. What we're doing now is we're actually addressing the very urgent and yet strategically low or medium importance. What we should be doing also in tandem with this is to go with long-term goals, not really urgent, but has to be done because it's high in strategic importance. What do I mean by that? Target number one is all about operational excellence, quick wins, arresting decline, urgent and important. Target number one. In target number one, it's all about institutional excellence. Now, excellence is about external assessment. People will judge whether we are excellent or not. Success is a different thing. Success is about us raising to our own potential, that's success. So, in trajectory number one, which is about, you know, we bring us until April 2020, there are a lot of initiatives that we've introduced. And on the 11th of March and on the 18th of March, the top management will be seeing everyone to describe trajectory number one. Remember, trajectory number one is about sorting our house. And we want to be excellent but it will not make us different. Trajectory number two is where we have to make difficult decisions for USM to be different. We will not talk about trajectory number two during the 11th of March or 18th of March meeting, but we will be talking to everyone by September this year with regards to a number of plans for us to be different compared to the rest, trajectory number two. Trajectory number two is all about ambition. Nothing good comes easy. And therefore, everyone has to be prepared so that USM will become the excellent, the leader that it set out to be a few years ago when it introduced the Apex program. We want to revive that Apex program we want to be the Apex University 
we want to be competitive in a global scale. We'll see you on the 11th and 18th. Thank you.